what's going on Scorpio gang 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 hope all is well with you guys to my Scorpio kisses mm -hmm. I love 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 you guys to the moon and back you know that to my returning OG subscribers what's popping what's good to my newly subscribed welcome 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 thank you for allowing the channel to continue to grow I appreciate that this is a Scorpio fair sun moon rising Venus north node anywhere you have Scorpio placements in your chart Grab your boo, your hookah, your blunt, your spliff, your Bible, your Quran, whatever it takes, Scorpio, to tap into these energies like we always do around about this time. If you should see an ad, let it play for a minute or so so your girl can get all the credit from YouTube. To all of you amazing folks who like, share, subscribe, donate to the channel, book me for readings. And send donations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. I really, really do. You're totally fucking amazing. All right. Let's get into the channel messages. Everything else is in the description box below. Let's get into it. Something very significant about a Gemini. I saw the Gemini card. What are the messages here for Scorpio? What are the messages here for Scorpio? I'm hearing God heard everything, even the plot twist. Somebody thought God was deaf. I'm also hearing something very significant about somebody's ears not popping during travel. I don't know why that's significant. If you're going to fly, chew bubblegum. That's too many. Chew bubblegum when you're going up in the air, right? Somebody might forget that because you had an argument before you're getting on the plane. I'm also hearing if you're getting on a plane, don't argue with anybody. Before you get on the plane, on the flight. Only good vibes when you're flying. Okay, I'm hearing that for somebody. Somebody very significant. Who's listening to me is about to catch a flight real soon or something. All right, I'm getting that. I'm channeling something about a flight here. Being good vibes, good spirits when you board the plane. That's very significant. 11-11, I'm hearing you are protected and being spiritually guided at this time. 7-14, somebody is suffering from chronic illness due to some type of um, hex or return to cinder, black magic. Somebody's from New Orleans, that's very significant. Your family bewitched you at birth. Something very significant about how your children treat you. It says ex-karmic wife burning candles on you. Yeah, I'm getting heavy Louisiana here. I'm also seeing Fulton County, Georgia tags. So you could have moved from Louisiana and tried to leave this karmic wife behind, start over new. This person is doing some type of witchcraft um, to lure you back to Louisiana. I'm really getting that about Louisiana. It says fire and brimstone, sickness and disease, homeless and instability, judgment is set. Yeah, so whoever whoever this karmic wife or husband is that's doing this, um, I'm getting moon magic, witchcraft, something, something about her burying something under the new moon is making you think heavily on the good times. And it's erasing your memory about the bad times. 4.14 on the um, clock. I'm hearing down by the bayou. I always hear that. Somebody's going to prison here. Something backfired real bad. Something, something somebody wanted to happen to you or your firstborn son is now happening to them and their firstborn son. Somebody also is putting their house up or has already putting their house up for bail to let their firstborn son out. He's going to skip bail. You're going to lose your house. You're going to be homeless and in, in um, facing instability here. Judgment is set. It says your father is under judgment. This feels like three people. 
This could be your father-in-law here. Okay, I feel like he's instructing your ex-karmic wife. I feel like whoever this father is, he's like a 12th generational root man or something like that, a root worker here. It says leaving behind to level up power. And then it says lying about who your father is. So something very significant about this person being up under judgment here, your father. Something about your father here is very significant, Scorpio. And it says, your past on father has a message for you. So yeah, something very significant about somebody's father who passed on. I feel like this person went to the grave thinking that they were not your father, but they are. I feel like your mother wanted somebody else to be your father. Oh, Lord. On the bottom of the deck, we have seven African powers here. Something very strong is being used to subdue you, Scorpio. It's to give you like fog brain. It's to make you, it's to scramble your signals here because the frequency that you're on, they cannot obtain that frequency. So what they're doing is scrambling that frequency so that you can either hear them or they can now hear you. I'm hearing something like that. Something very significant about this message from your past on father that's under that went under judgment or for some of y'all, y'all father's still living, but they're under judgment, meaning they could be about to pass away. And then that would be the message. I feel like this person is only going to speak this from the grave. They would never tell you in, in life that they love you or whatever this is. OK, I'm getting that real, real, real bad. OK, let's clarify ex karmic wife burning candles on you. Yeah, whoever this is, you divorced male or female. OK, this person wants revenge. This ex wife will not let you be somewhere free and living life. Very, very significant um, is Creole descent. Um, I'm hearing something very significant about Hooduism. Okay, so Hooduism could be your your religion or your um, practice here. Tell about his ex karmic burning candles. I feel like y'all both come from the same background, but you know, you you come from you come from different levels of witchcraft of hoodoo. I feel like whoever this wife is, she comes from the dark side, and you're much more you're much more of the light here. Yeah, the six of swords. See, I'm telling you. You moved away from this person, this ex, you divorced them or something, you f you find, found out something that they were doing to you. I feel like you found out this person was demonic. I'm getting something very significant about black eyes, no white, okay? I'm getting something very significant. You could have saw this person shape shift and it scared the shit out of you, Scorpio, but you couldn't show fear, but it shook your ass to the core. Okay, the two of cups is coming out in the reverse. This is somebody who feels like they are your person. You're turning your back on this two of cups and you're moving forward. But this person, they're trying to do witchcraft to draw you back. And what they're trying to do is make you think about this two of cups situation when it was in its honeymoon phase. Okay, you don't remember no fucking good times, but this is what the witchcraft is supposed to do. Look, six of cups. Make you nostalgic, make you think about the good times, the old times with them, making you reminisce and wanting to come back. Because this person feels like if they have access to you, even like you calling them Scorpio on the phone, this person feels like they'll be able to enter your energy. Because I feel like at the end of the day, that's what this person is trying to do. They're trying to be slick and enter your energy for some reason. But the tower is here. Everything they try to do, it, it it just disintegrates. No weapon formed against you can ever prosper. This person, they said these same prayers with you, so they already know what's going on. They just think that they can outdo God. The fool card. I just feel like you leaving this situation leveled you up. 
Okay, I feel like you didn't lie to anybody, Scorpio, and I feel like whoever this loser is, they they just want you to be there to validate them. Or they want you to be there to continue to care for them. Or they want you to be there so they can still be in that suck of his energy and just like leech off of your energy till they can't no more, till you're fucking sick, until you're like um homeless, okay? That's what I'm getting, because that's what fire and brimstone, this lady has abused her authority too many times. And the thing that's pissing spirit off is she actually think nobody sees it. That's why I heard God say he heard he was there. He heard the plot, even the plot, the plot twist. He heard the plot and the plot twist. Neither one of them will work. Something very significant about the seven African powers. That's the overall energy. Somebody's family line is very powerful, whether it be dark or light energy here. When they speak a thing, it happens, okay? They have to be very careful with how they use spell work 1111 on the timer. They're very conscious of this. That's why it's so weird that they're doing this thinking God don't see them, okay? Yeah, the devil. On fire and brimstone, sickness and disease, homeless instability judgment is set. So this, this karmic wife or husband, they abuse and father, whoever this is, they abuse their abilities one too many times. Or it's just the fact that it's you, Scorpio. Yeah, it's just the fact that it's you, the death card. Thank you, Source. So this is, you know, death in the devil. This this is black ass fucking witchcraft. It don't get no darker than that. This person wants revenge, Scorpio. This person wants you sick, diseased, homeless, and unstable. And I'm getting mostly in your mind with that. This person wants to control you. This person wants you to be that person that sits there all day like a fucking pin doll or voodoo or hoodoo doll and just do whatever you tell them to do. And it's like, no, you showing up as the king of swords. You cut this bitch off or this nigga off and you got the fuck on and you don't care what they got going on. They can be burning candles on top of fucking candles and blowing hoodoo dust and sticking pins in the doll. It's not going to fucking work. The five of swords. This person is going crazy now. Now this person understand the ramification of what they done. They try to make you feel, you know, nostalgic and think about the honeymoon phase and want to come back. And now it's controversy going on in their mind. What do I mean when I say controversy? They ask going crazy now because the shit's not working. You're not returning. And they know what? Their their privileges has have been abused and revoked. Okay. They know judgment is set. This person also knows without the covering of their gifts, any spiritual practitioner or white witch, dark witch can take their ass straight out. So right now, this person, they in the open. Why? Because judgment is set. They need to be in the fucking open. Yeah, the emperor. Judgment has been set by you, Scorpio. You are the authority. Okay, what the fuck they thought? I feel like death, you know, outranks the devil. He can't do shit without death permission. And death can't do shit without God's permission. So it's like, who are we? Where, where's the devil at really on this food chain? You're at the bottom, bitch. You're under my feet. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. Whoever this is, Scorpio, they're in your energy. They're going to be very sick. It's going to be very noticeably sick. It's going to be like overnight. Somebody here is aging too overnight. The next time you see this person, they're going to look like they're 20 years older than you. And y'all were born damn near on the same day. What I say? Clarify going to prison. Whoever this was who stole your inheritance or your insurance money, they're going to jail. It might not be for your insurance money, but they're going to jail for something they done. Yeah, the Hierophant. This is an institution. Somebody going to fucking jail. Yeah, you're not going to you're not going to um fit the feds either. You're you're going to state jail. Okay, well you'll be able to join together with other um criminals like yourself. I feel like this is gonna be a, a a a very very um uncomfortable stay. Okay, I'll say that the six of wands is in the reverse. They don't take too kindly to people stealing people's 
children's money and shit like that or whatever this person is going to prison for. Okay, this could be a pedophile. This could be your father. This could be a message from your father. Your father could have died in prison. Okay, I'm getting that too for being a pedophile. Like I said, I don't feel like this person, your father could apologize on this side. But now that they've crossed over, they want to apologize. They never do it to your face. They never admit that they did it. The five of wands is in the reverse. They'll never admit that they did this to you. At all, period. Over and over again, I'm hearing just this. This is something. Um, I feel like you're just not willing to fight about it anymore. You're not. You're not going to try to talk to this person about it no more. You. You. You left it behind. When they went to prison, okay. I feel like you may have tried to have some type of relationship with your father. I feel like it's too late. Judgment has been set. Yeah, the two of wands. The, the, the decision has been made. This person's destiny is set. But I feel like his message is coming from the other side. He's able, yeah, look, the eight of so ace of swords. I can't make it up. From the other side, he's able to speak the truth to you, Scorpio. But he could never look in your eyes in the 3D and tell you, yeah, I did that. I'm a piece of shit. I'm a low down, whatever the fuck. He can't do it. But when he cross over, he does. He tells you that. That's the message. So somebody, that's for somebody. It says your father is under judgment. For some of y'all, this could be your ex going to prison and needing your help. <laughs> yeah, this is your ex or somebody kin to you. Somebody very close. The Ten of Pentacles is coming out in the reverse. Or somebody who pretended to be close. This is somebody too that was doing the most. That really thought they got away with the money. <laughs> yeah, they don't even have the money no more. It's like they spent this money they stole from you years of fucking go. And now they going to prison. Your ass going to prison broke. You're going to prison without loved ones. People who love you have long gone. Like God was setting your ass up. The eight of wands in reverse. Yeah, this person, this person finna ride the paddy wagon. They're going to state prison. They're going to do a bid. I'm hearing eight to eight to ten years here. They could get out in seven, do the good behavior, but they'll be on paper. Yeah, the hangman. What I said. What I said. It's no way around this. This person is being judged. There's no way around it. Everybody see this person for who they are, what they done. The evidence is overwhelming. Okay, yeah, look, the Ace of Pentacles. It's like they took this fucking money from nowhere and put it in their checking account with no job, no, you know, nothing but monthly income, and, and, and they've been under investigation. They've been under investigation, and then when the people come to talk to them or knock on their door, guess what they tell the people? My daughter told me to put it in, in my bank account because, you know, she going through it with her karmic husband or her karmic wife. No, bitch, I didn't. You stole it, and you spent it, and it don't show you ever pulling nothing down and giving shit to Scorpio. What I said, this person going to prison. Your father's under judgment because of this shit. Something very significant about somebody speaking from speaking something to you from their deathbed, Scorpio. Okay, or from the grave. I'm also hearing whoever this person is that did this to you. They need for you to tell them it's okay for them to go. This is somebody on their deathbed wanting you to forgive them, but they never acknowledge to you that they did a fuck thing. And they never will. But they want to hear you say, just hear you say that, they, that you forgive them. That's very significant for somebody. And for somebody, they, they, want, they want out of this world now. They want to go, they want to cross over. And it's up to you, Scorpio. They need your okay. They're in a living hell right now. Your father is under judgment. And here you are, the nine of cups. Now, this, this person ain't had no dealings with you all your life. All your life. But now they need the nine of cups. Now they need the wish fulfillment. Now they need the say so. Now they need the connection. Who am I talking to? They on their deathbed and all they want and need is your connection. They want you to release them from this living hell. 
And Scorpio, if you think they never thought about you and never thought about this, you're crazy. That's why they've been on drugs. That's why they've been trying to... That's why they've been homeless. That's why they, they've been suffering bad. God made it fully known to these people what they've done and the repercussions of what they've done is. They're under judgment. Lying about who your father is. All right. Let's see what this is about. I feel like your mother lied about who your father is because your real father molested you or did something like that. I'm getting that. This person, this person, a pedophile, they went to jail for, for pedophilia. Okay. So I'm picking up on that. They keep telling me that. Um, and in another storyline, somebody's karmic is going to prison. They put this money in their account like they had it like that or some shit like that. They've been under investigation. All right. Lying about your father with pulling the nine of wands. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I feel like this is a mother who set some type of perimeter around you or some type of protection mechanism she couldn't tell this person that this was their daughter or something like that because I, I, I or i'm getting i'm getting to like um your mother uh, yeah I'm, I'm getting to for 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 some of you scorpios i feel like your mother began to deny your father to do what he was doing to you. At first, I feel like she was with it. I'm getting that. I also feel like, as strange as this is, y'all, I just heard it. This ex-karmic wife was your mother in another life. She tried to protect you from your father too late. And how she did that was... By telling him you were not his or something, something very sick like that. The Queen of Cups is here. Yeah, I feel like your mother was very like protective of who your father is. For some of you Scorpios who this storyline applies to, this is why your mom never let you know who your father was, because the indiscretions of your father. Okay, if you have siblings, sisters, and brothers, they went through the same thing too. The Seven of Wands is here. I feel like for some reason, Scorpio, you were the only one your mama stood up for in the ninth inning, though. The damage was already done. You could be a firstborn child, is what I'm getting. You're the moon card. I feel like your mom would play like she was asleep. She felt your father getting out of bed. She know he was going out of the room. She knows the period of time that it takes for him to go and molest you and come back. I'm getting this right now. I'm telling this, guys. Your mother didn't, do, does not want to associate this person. Being This could be your stepfather. Okay, thank you, Source. The world card is here. I feel like a generational generational curse was broken when your mom died, okay? For some of y'all, this could be your mother from the from the from on the bedside or from the grave. Take it how it resonates. This could be the karmic father, father or mother here. Your mother went through immense guilt or your father, whoever this was, they're really drug addicted. They could have even been street walkers, okay? Because they know they, they gave you, they prostituted you out with your real father. It don't matter whether it was your real father or your stepfather. They did it knowingly and tried to cover this shit up with the, with the moon here. And then after this shit done happened to you, your siblings, then now it's like all of a sudden this person want to have an epiphany and act like they know what's going on now and they're trying to protect you by saying this isn't your father or this isn't your mother or some shit like that. I don't know, some weird out shit. I'm here and don't let their ass know it's time to go. You forgave them already, Scorpio. Don't even go to the hospital is what I'm hearing. It says your past on father has a message for you. What's the message for Scorpio? The Empress. This person knew all the while you were their daughter. 
Okay, that's what I'm trying to tell you. It's something very, something weird about this karmic ass mama with this fucking moon, the world card, the seven of wands, the queen of cups, and then the nine of wands. It's like you didn't protect your children, bitch, and you knew what was going on. Like, I don't know what else to fucking say. She knew this was happening to all the girl children with whoever this man was, whether it was your daddy or stepdaddy. That's all I want to say. The eight of pentacles is here. She knew what this person was doing. This person did this for stability. To have a nice place to stay or something like this. She prostituted her children. Yeah, the seven of cups. This is somebody who's very confused, delusional. Somebody who do drugs. I said they're a streetwalker. This shit ran them crazy. So your past on father or mother want to tell you how sorry they are. If you miss the hospital bid... They're going to suffer a lot. And then they're going to pass on. And then that's when. Because for some reason in the 3D. They want you to just say I forgive you. And you, you you know. You can go now. And it's like no bitch. It's not that easy. Okay. Because I feel like a lot of you Scorpios have been homeless. You've been sick. You've had diseases. And you just God healed you. But these were direct shots at you. Witchcraft. Okay. People, people waking up every day doing affirmations, wanting to take you out. Clarify this empress here. Like, real sick bitches. Your judgment. Clarifying the empress. Judgment came about with these people because what they did to you, Scorpio. What they thought you'd never find out, but you did. The Ace of Wands. You found out what happened. And you forgave this person. That's why you moved forward. That's why God was able to elevate you. But you ain't got to go tell this person that they're free to go. I feel like with the Ace of Wands being here in the judgment, I feel like this is just a, this is you answering the call. What's the call? The call is whatever that was before these people stole from you or started burning fucking candles on you. The Queen of Wands, you being back to your original state now because all generational curses and cycles have been broken. I feel like even from the grave, this person wants some type of relief and I'm here, it's not going to happen. <laughs> I feel like you're being protected from them. Like you can't, they can't even reach you from the other side. They could, they can't even, this is the only thing they're going to be able to channel here is what I'm hearing. Judgment is set. Clarify this Eight of Pentacles. This is what it is. Ain't, ain't no revising. Yeah. On the Eight of Pentacles, the star. This person took your essence is what I'm getting. And the people that were supposed to protect you, protect your cre creativity, protect your childlike energy. You were a child. Like, they was the one busting you up. Yeah, the King of Pentacles. I'm telling you, your mama did this for stability. And shame on you, you dirty, low-down-ass, filthy, low excuse for a fucking woman, bro. Your justice. I can't make this shit up. These people are going to suffer, and they're going to die. And they're going to die without knowing whether or not you forgave them. And I feel like that's their fucking judgment in itself. Clarify the Seven of Cups. There was no confusion. They just wanted to... This Your mother, with her deceptive ass, she wanted it to appear... As though she had nothing, she knew nothing about this. The two of swords, bitch, yes you did. You helped, you helped him rape your children. You made the decision. What you was, what you call stuck in the middle, because this two of swords is giving me like somebody who feel like they stuck between a rock and a hard place. Bitch, it's a no-brainer. A grown fucking man is raping his child. Your fucking child. What do you fucking mean stability? Fuck stability. Okay, yeah, the Knight of Swords. I'm telling you, this man will come in straight from work and go and start molesting the children. For some of the younger ones, he'd wait until all the rest of the children were asleep. And he'd get out of the bed with your karmic, filthy, disgusting-ass mom or dad, take it how it resonates, and rape these children. The Three of Pentacles. Sometimes he would do two of, of them at a time, make them, play with them, make them play with themselves, make them touch him. Fundling them. This person is locked behind bars for the rest of their life. And they, this person, whoever this father is, that I'm talking about who's gone to prison or whatever, 
they 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 die in prison. They get so sick they have to be moved to a hospital. They need you to come in. They call the immediate family. I feel like you may be the only family this bitch got. That's another indication that this is your father. This is a this is a family lie. This is a family secret. Thank you, source. That's what this is. This this moon with the seven of wands, the queen of cups, and the nine of wands. This is a family secret. This is a family secret. This this is a family. This one's supposed to come out with the ace of swords here, but he did. And it's out. And everybody who's involved in this shit, they going to jail or hell, just period. On the bottom of the deck, you have the ten of cups. And that's totally your energy, okay? That's the energy you've been in. Like, you, don't, you didn't even really know this type of shit was going on, okay? Other than the fact of what they did to you, the indiscretion. But the family secret is your mother knew the whole while, okay? All right, Scorpio, if you're still with me, like, subscribe. Let those ads play for a minute or so. If you're interested in the personal readings, I'm offering $44.44 .44 readings today. I love you. See you in the next video.